Dear friends, today I am going to review Son of POWR2. This is actually 15 amps switch with uh, it will support up to 3500 watts. You can use this for uh, air conditioner or oven or motor. Even 6 amps also you can uh, use. But you can measure that uh, how much watts it is consuming and uh, how much amps it is live using. What is the low out live outputs volt of the device like air conditioner or uh, oven, micro oven or motor because uh, the household items which product you will think it will take more power no those are the device how much it is coming it, it is consuming monthly you can easily monitor with the device with this device in this you need to before buy this you need to see this is only fully loaded POWR2 even one more is there it is 16 amps Son of TH 16 amps. Okay, it won't support anything, but you can run on off through this device. But it got a temperature sensor also. You can view the temperature sensor, but you cannot view what is the voltage consuming in that machines. You cannot measure how many unit it is consuming, but you can measure only this one. POWR2. In this also, one more device coming, only POW. In that it will show us only live current. It won't show how much watts it was measured. Okay, this one is POWR2 is fully loaded. It is up to, it will support up to 15 amps under 3500 watts. You can measure your home appliance. You feel microwave will consume more watts or your geyser will consume more watts or your AC consume more watts you can easily monitor what is the live, live current live, live power output and uh, average how much it is consuming and monthly how much how many unit it has been consumed everything it can be monitored it cost around um, 1100 compared to this this is 16 amps only on off or uh, other regular future but it doesn't have that um, live current measuring or watts measuring or uh, uh, total consuming current and all but it costs those around 600 rupees it costs 1100 rupees in Ali Express I have not paid any extra duties, I have not paid, any, paid any, any extra charges, only I paid 600 rupees, 1100 rupees AliExpress. If you want, I will share the link in the description columns. I'll this is out of box cover, still having the, all the details, remote control, <coughs> timing schedule, power measuring smart sense it will support 8 enabled timers it will support 240 volt to 15 amps and the maximum power current 3500 watts residue load <coughs> you can configure the same with uh, Amazon Alexa or Google Home or Nest or IFTT I am opening the device. This is the device. 
only all the connections will be one side. We will give three manuals. Only, only one thing is very important. This is the details. P O W R two. This is the sensor you can temperature sensor you can insert. This barcode scanner and other manual. This is very important manual. One side will be Chinese. This is actually Chinese. Okay, and the other side will be English. If you are reading this, you will get hundred percent fully idea about. If you are reading this clearly, you can do the self installation. There is no need of any electricians because you need <coughs> modem. The modem range should be there up to where you are installing the device. This is the wire diagram individually. And connecting with uh, they given example heaters, appliance wiring, and uh, above one input. This one is a geyser, and this one for light. This is the features. What it is? This is how to pair. They are saying you need to press the button for seven second to get the pairing mode. This is line earth and uh, line output and earth and line input neutral. This is my borewell motor box. It is five stage motor submersible pump. <laughs> currently 10 volt 0 ohms because it is not on once you are switch on the device you will get the ohms I am going to give live current input only to this and not you ok live current input because this is st starter you cannot connect <coughs> the motor will get the effect ok for that reason only I am going to connect the live current input you make sure that when you are connecting with starter and all you need to connect only where you are getting live current input there you need to connect This is the past you only like to only two wires. I have cut it small two wires. First I am going to plug this in with the Sanaf. I am going to cover, remove that Sanaf cover. And I am going to plug into the output. Let this output, line output. And uh, yellow is earth. Sorry, neutral. This is only plug press type. You can press that you can insert the wire. I have done that. Okay. Now I am going to disconnect that meter wire. I am going to give that live current input into this enough. Before that, I have to check with the tester whether current is coming or not. You switch on the main. Sorry, switch off the main. I am disconnecting. Make sure that uh, wire sleeves and all clearly it should be cut. That won't be 
sleeve extra it will make sure that it will give the short circuit or burning okay that is very important thing when you are doing yourself the sleeve should not come out of that sun of hole it should be the wire should be fully covered with that hole since it is huge current it will may <coughs> If it is anything, sleeves are coming out and making the short circuits. It may affect more. It will give more effect, burning or shocking or something like that. I am connecting that wire to the sun of device. Just push the button and pull. Put into that hole. It will catch that wire. Afterwards, you need to cover that. So now that before that, we should give the live current input. Now, I am going to give. Take live current input for sun of device. This is simple wiring. When you are watching that, you will get an idea. There is no need of Keeping electrician also, you will understand easily. Afterwards, I am going to close that sun of covers. I am going to close that sun of cover, plugging with the screw. Pressing for 5 seconds to get the pairing mode. <coughs> now it is in the pairing mode. I am going to pair <coughs> with my, my mobile app. I already downloaded. I have to connect with my internet modem. I have already connected many devices with my app. I am using already. I am going to. This is the pairing mode. How the light will blink. It will ask your uh, modem password. After inputting that. It is getting connected. Got connected. I'm going to rename it. <coughs> Borewell motor. Actually, I plugged into the borewell motor only. That is the reason I'm going to give you borewell motor. See, it is got connected. Okay. It has the Wi-Fi signal also. How how much it is strength is the right side column. There is everything zero watts, volt, amps. Everything zero. it is asking firmware update i'm going to give update settings 
and uh, there will be update okay so it is getting updated 5% close that box I'm going to switch on the motor <coughs> now it is 0 watts 0 ohms 211 volt I'm going to switch on the motor switch it on the motor it is 2738 watts it is showing 13.97 amps 197 volt <coughs> it is showing see you will get a clear watts amps and volt This is the easy way you can monitor. <coughs> See the <coughs> switch it off and again I'm going to switch on the motor. Switch it off and again I'm going to switch on the motor. Starting it is giving 5000 watts, afterwards it shows 2736 watts. While start it is giving huge watts, afterwards it is giving 2700 watts. You can monitor the how much it is consumed kilowatts like unit in the statistic, real time statistic. And this is the actual what live current 2737.96 watts 14 amps and 196 volt there is other features under timer and scheduled and sharing This is what you can install this machine to your air conditioner also because you want to know what exactly how much per night it is consuming watts <coughs> like a micro oven because three things are huge power consuming device electric water heater and a micro oven and air conditioners you can use three device I am using for this borewell motor thank you by Guru Motor reducing the pressure the arms will reduce watts will reduce this is the board I have inserted I have closed with plug should not be for some dust and other things